All right, so it's that time of year for teachers to make video slideshows uh, featuring their students from my last uh, school year. And if you're on Windows 10 like I am and you're missing Windows Movie Maker, which was in Windows 7, um, let's take a look at Microsoft Photos. I think Movie Maker has kind of been rolled into Photos. So on my Windows 10 machine, I'm going to click on this search right here and then click in the search area and type photos and this app the very first app is Microsoft photos um, and I've already added <coughs> two videos and a few pictures of WFASD um, so the way I did that was click right here on the import button and you can search for pictures on your hard drive it's fairly simple to do once you've done all that I'm going to click on create and custom video that was create and custom video and I can select individual photos or I can select all 10 <coughs> and think these are kind of broken down into different days and whatnot but yeah so um, I select it all and create and now it is going to throw those together for me name that something real quick <clears throat> so as you can see I have a bunch of photos that I can move around um, I have a few things I'll probably trim some of these out just because uh, my screen is like really small so I'm gonna close that one Alifia I love you but I'm gonna close that one all right so now I can manage my project a little bit easier so first off let's take a look at this very first photo I can change the duration in seconds I can resize it um, I can add some filters as in uh, change the you know color make it black and white sepia or whatever I can add text to this photo and say who's in the picture and what they're doing um, I can add some motion, which we'll talk about that in a minute up here in themes, which is really cool. Um, and then 3D effects. So, of course, I'm going to need some atomic motion. Let's just start with that one. And I'm going to need my atomic motion to be really large. So let's play my atomic motion. Don't know if y'all saw that or not, but yeah, there you, you can add cool little 3D effects. Um, let's try just one more. Um, let's throw a, let's give Brittany Prickett a dinosaur. Because Brittany loves dinosaurs. And in effects, I can go to 3D library and add a dinosaur into my picture huh. so there is our dinosaur and we're gonna make him uh, we're gonna make him turn and he does have volume by the way <coughs> but I'm gonna turn that down so now let's see what we got This picture doesn't have anything. There's Brittany's dinosaur. So yes, clearly it's going to go through all my pictures, and I can adjust the duration, like I mentioned, on every one of these pictures. So let's see what happens to my video. Hello, everyone. I'm Jessica Nalas with News Channel 6. I'm outside Fania Elementary for Digital Learning Day. School administrators are taking a tour of these schools and seeing what the kids are learning when it comes to... All right, as you can imagine, that is a <clears throat> news clip, and it's rather long. It's 3 minutes and 20 seconds. I don't have time for that, so I'm going to trim this video. I've selected this video. This one's 1 minute 50. This one is, sorry, that was my whole slideshow. It's 320. This video is 1 minute 10 seconds. Um, so let's click on that and trim it down. Um, like I said, it's 1 minute 11 seconds. I just want 
Jesse Canales. I really want a short clip. Let's just make this real quick. So now I've uh, adjusted that video and um, it's only going to play for six seconds. Notice my total video time went way down. Um, and yeah, let's look at this video as well. If you're just very, very exciting yeah. happening this weekend, the WFISD Teacher Job Fair. Peter, thank you so much oh, for coming on the show you. bright and here. early. Yeah. All right. Again, let's just get to the information that I need. Uh, we'll just do that right there. For the sake of this video, I'm just cutting this down to like 10 seconds. And I can drag this 10 seconds around, do whatever I want. Pretty cool. Uh, click done. So there you go. Um, and I'll move that up here to the front. All right. Um, that is about it. Uh, oh, yeah. Let's talk about music. Of course, I can add music to my um, to my video. This is... Uh, So that was a list of um, like stock free media. And if you want to, of course, you can add your own songs. So if you want to get Green Day Time of My Life from 1999, you can just download that and throw it in your video. I'm not going to select any video or any audio because I'm trying to give a demo right now. Um, the other thing you should look at is themes. We can add an adventure. So let's see what happens now. If you're thinking about becoming a teacher, and you might not have that certification yet, we'll have universities and some other alternative certification programs there to help you with that. Um, our starting salary is about 43000 So yeah, we just made a slideshow. Not that hard. Some outside Fane Elementary for digital learning date. All right, here's my favorite part. Very easy to export. Um, I'm gonna click on this button right here, or share, or whatever you want to call that button. Um, and I'm just gonna choose medium. This is small quality, medium quality, lo uh, large quality. So depending on what file size you want, um, you can select whatever you want to do. But yeah, that is about it. And it's going to download as an MP4, which is the choice um, video uh, for the internet for basically computers these days. Most people are making videos in this format, uh, especially for uploading to YouTube. So there you go. Um, that is about it. Thank you all very much.